Well, it's time to give this place some water. This whole, I mean, these gardens are cute, right? And you could water this. <gasps> Just, what? <gasps> no way. There's like a whole little cauliflower. Cauliflower down there. What? Wow. Should you pick it? I don't know. Anyways, we gotta build a proper water system. So the house has some rainwater, it's beautiful water, but it is not enough water for gardens. And Rose just keeps building more gardens. <gasps> but then we also got the animals. We got the chickens and the ducks over there. They need water. And then up the hill, by the girl's house, we got goats and pigs and bigger gardens. So, <laughs> what? I just can't get over it. Oh, get over what? There's a cauliflower in there. <laughs> yeah, I know. I've yeah, never grown a, cauliflower It's before. a cauliflower, yeah. Wow. Anyways, the water system. So we have a beaver pond, but it is a thousand feet over there. And so we can use a little Honda pump and we're gonna pump it up a thousand feet. And we built a stand up on the hill, a big tank, a thousand gallons. So a thousand feet, a thousand gallons. And then from up the hill, we can run another thousand feet of lines all the way to all the different animal pens and all the different gardens. So, should we go build a water system? Mm -hmm. We are building the most amazing off-grid, gravity-fed water system ever. Oh, for the house, you're gonna have showers now. Uh, not for the house. Okay. If you don't have water, your gardens don't grow. Water is life. It's, I, I feel like it probably says that in the Bible, <laughs> right? If you don't have water, your gardens don't grow. So today, Dad rented a ditch with detachment for the tool cat. We're gonna dig ditches to bury some pipe. In fact, I'd asked Kezia to kind of, you know, guide me yep. in, right? <laughs> right? But, and she was just playing with the camera, turns out. Okay. Because I inadvertently went right into the stuck when you hole. you saw her point the camera that way, you thought, okay. I thought, go that go way. Go that way. It was a really bad idea mm. uh, to try and to, to do trust what I was oh, do I doing there. you going to say to trust No, Kezia. I bear, you know, I'm the adult. Yeah. Right? <laughs> so, but it'll be no problem. We're going to... Like, lickety-split. <laughs> so, Dad got stuck, and so we're trying to fix it. It's disgusting. Um, let's use it. These, these little guys could be cut into... I was going to say, few. do you want these cut again? Yep. Okay, let me see if I can get moving at all.
What a disaster. Oh my goodness. Well, we have a very long ditch to dig by hand now. It's pretty mucky right now. Yep. And late. Well, why aren't we digging this? Why did we not dig it before? Where have you been? I was right here. You were not right here. <sighs> what a disaster. Why didn't you dig it with the ditch witch? Oh my goodness. Maybe this was a bad idea for today. We've had so much rain. <sighs> well, this is not the, uh, it's not the ditch we were hoping for tonight. Yeah. All smashed in and messed up, hey? Good thing we got kids to dig it mm. by hand. Ugh. Hey, workers. Hey. I'm having a kid break. That doesn't look like work. But she's so cute, right? I know, but we have a ditch to fill with pipe. You tell her that. Hey, we have a ditch to dig. You hear me? If you gave a five-year-old an excavator and asked him to dig, like like spell his name in the dirt by, and that's what it looked like. This is only like a 50-foot piece and it's taking forever. Yeah. But we got, we have we a got thousand miles. feet of pipe to put in the ground. Anyways, we have one more day. We got one more day with this machine. Because it's rented. We're gonna, we gotta, well, and yeah. If, if you're late returning We it, rented that thing. You're paying for a And it's gotta be clean. We gotta Ooh. clean that thing off. We're gonna need some water. <laughs> How are you gonna get the water without, oh man. That's like the ultimate catch 22. So this morning before I got up, dad already dug all this. Up to a T here. Went down there, all the way to the ducks, and over here, all the way to the shop. make a machine for cleaning out these bits, eh? Yeah. Oh, wait. They do. You want me to cut it? Huh? Uh, you want me to cut it? Why? It kind of looks like you're going to slice your hand. You think I'm going to slice my hand? Yeah. Christina, I've handled a few knives before. Yesterday was a bit of a disaster. We, what? Uh, like two cups of dirt just went inside my boots. I mean, what are the odds, right? What are the odds? I can't imagine why you would get dirt in your boots. Oh, more. It's such a yucky feeling. I don't know, I think you like it. Oh my goodness, and my legs are getting scarred. <laughs> Roots. Okay, that's enough complaining. I was I was the one complaining here. Listen, I'm the one complaining. I'm complaining about I'm how this happened yesterday. What a disaster. Oh man. Anyways, work moved on today and went quite well, hey girls? What? That's hardly two cups, Rose. That's only one foot. That was embarrassing. And I already like dumped out half of it. Oh yeah, I can see it right there, hey? That looks, I can see the dirt down in your boot. I know. That's my favorite feeling is that right there. <laughs> wow. 
Hey, but all this so that your gardens can have water and the goats can have water. Small price to pay, hey girls? Yeah. So anyways, this is quite a production line. We got pipe in the ground. You girls are uh, king at this. Oh. What'd you lose? You buried the top of the rake again. What? Are you sure it's in there? You have... Yeah, it's right here. Maybe so, yeah. Oh yeah. Hey, keep your rake head away from my water line. Hey, yes, sir. Look at this production. You got the caution tape. Hey, how's work going back there? Kind of looks like a union job right there. It looks easy to backfill. Super easy, just a little production line, pipe in the ground. Rake it in, caution two tape. That's two. that's perfect. That's I mean, yeah. caution tape. It was almost like a, you'd rented another this machine is, to do I, that. <laughs> I watched that the the clip of Rose with a knife like three or four times, and each time I got more nervous. <laughs> I don't think uh, watch it in slow motion. See, yeah. see how close she gets. You got to see this in slow mo. <laughs> That's wild, hey? Yeah. I mean, I'm sure the camera angle, you know, maybe it wasn't that close. It was, it was close. that close. <laughs> <laughs> and like moments after her her 11-year-old daughter warned her. Warned her. 12-year-old. Yeah. 12. It's important. Yeah. I almost wish it drew blood. <laughs> like I wish it would have been I just wish it would have nicked the pants. Without the, drawing yeah, blood. yeah. I mean, yeah, not that, that I would been. want her to draw yeah, blood, no. but I mean, that's, that's blood a trip would. into town. We gotta get this thing done. We gotta hook this up. Yeah, I'm but, thirsty. But we actually have to. Uh, we just gotta backfill the uh, the swamp now. Good luck. I feel like an excavator. Look at this. You look like an excavator. <laughs> Where were you the other day? I wouldn't even have tried to come in here with the machine. All we needed was a whole string of these girls. Hey, how is it? Kind of deep and muddy. I just don't know what to say. It's a dirty job, but uh, that that someone's got to do it. Watch your fingers. Oh, I almost stabbed you. This is gross. <laughs> this was supposed to be pretty easy. And then we made a huge mess. <sighs> well, that, girls, is a gross disaster. But you know what? In like 20 minutes, we're gonna have water pumping through here. Uh, hey? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, hopefully. Yeah, I do hope. Imagine if it doesn't work. <laughs> That'll be hilarious. Like the magic ingredient for a homestead, water. We got a thousand gallon tank, about five feet off the ground. There's our input line in the top. And here's our output. Look at that, we could run a line to uh, like a pool or something. Yeah. <laughs> Check out the water. Is it coming out? Yep, I can hear it. Oh man. Yeah. Right on. 
Look at that, eh? And so, water. So wasteful. Just for demonstration purposes. <laughs> okay, and then we got another thousand feet of line going to all sorts of different places. Yeah. Let's go uh, check some of them out. Okay. Unbelievable. What a journey this water's gone, hey? Yeah. Like 2,000 feet. Yeah. Went from the beaver pond, Honda pump, up the hill into the tank, down the hill out of the tank, and now behold. Behold. You, you have the, the power of prosperity in your hands. We do. So we have water everywhere. We got it everywhere. We got it at the ducks and the chickens, That's greenhouse, lower gardens, upper gardens and the pigs and the goats and the house of course no man did you just forget or you ran out of pipe it would be i don't even think rose wants it <laughs> i don't think you know rose very well no i mean it's rose? it's complicated um, yeah, as soon sure. as you have water in the house. I'm sure that conversation is complicated. <laughs> this house was never designed for water. It was never designed to live in for more than a year. It wasn't even designed. Remember in the old days when like a well was the wealth of your like homestead or your community? Like if you had a good well, or a good spring, you were wealthy yeah. because... Wealthy, that's where the term wealthy comes from. Now that we have water... Our pigs are plumper, our carrots are plumper, our I'm plumper. <laughs> and I'm just, I'm going to drain all the water that collects on your side into my, my pond. So I, that's really what I'm hoping to accomplish. You're just trying to drain my water. Yeah. Hmm. 